And today I'm gonna share some things with you uh, about uh, how to sing like foam euro from Radiohead, and especially I'm gonna have an um, example from Street Spirit, which I I did a cover I think a couple of years ago, if I'm not wrong. Yeah. TV. All right. So the first thing is the falsetto. You have to master the falsetto tone in order to sing any of the 90s mm, pop rock uh, styles. So, You should do several times the transition from the chest, head, towards the falsetto in order to really master the tone, really master how can you go from point A to point B. And in order to do that in a better and easier way, uh, you should slow down the, the song. You can find out which are the, the notes, the notes are here. A, B, A, B, A, E. So it's A to E. And that's a fifth. You really have to do that several times. You can even go higher sometimes, try something crazy, like go, I don't know. In order to just uh, work, uh, work out more the muscles around that area. So that uh, it's gonna feel easier if you just work out in a tougher area like this. Of course, always you just have to uh, engage the abdominals, the engage the diaphragm. By the way, I have some free tips for you. You can just click the, the link below and download them. All right. Uh, the next thing is gonna be the vowel magic. So, what is the vowel magic? Especially in this kind of songs, you have to really focus on the light tone and only on the vowels. So, open mouth, smiley face. Yeah. If you close the mouth, you can go anywhere. You know, or just keep it here. You don't have to build anything here. Everything has to be the head voice. Yeah, yeah. Put some cry in. It's easy. It's not that hard. You don't have to put so much effort into it. It has to be effortless and 
it has to be uh, lighter, okay? And it has it has to be uh, in a low volume. You have to sing that in a low volume. You don't have to shout. You have to yell at all in these kind of songs, all right? It's, it's not like you sing something, you know, let's try something crazy, okay? Let's see if it's gonna work. Work down and then go to C. Down. So you, this is a completely different part. If you try something that, like this, okay, it's com a, a completely different method in order to sync like this. We don't want power. We don't want to really push it. We just want be light and engage the note in a way that I just you know feel the dynamics I know it's difficult when you just you know have really low volume and you are in your True chords and not the false chords like falsetto because in falsetto it's, it's much easier to do. Okay, good. Another thing is you don't have uh, to care about the rains. Uh, Radiohead songs don't have, you know, no, of course not all of them. <laughs> not be misunderstood okay but most of them are not songs that I have you know that crazy uh, rock range you, know, you can hear um, in many songs okay especially of the grunge era or the 70s or whatever so you don't have to really uh, thought too much of it you just have to sing in a way that it feels right because I know that most of you have those notes, but you have to be confident and believe all that. Otherwise, you just you know um, you're gonna feel like ah I don't have it. Uh, what I'm doing, you have to just be really into that and you know exercise, work out on this. Thing you know, it's not a day night thing. You know, you have to work um, a lot in order to just um, achieve what what your goal is. Okay, if, if the goal is to sing like uh, someone else, you know, if you're like your favorite singer, of course you have to work out on that thing. You know, it's not like you take a guitar and, and play something really special. You know, you have to really play a lot to do that you know it's, it's too much effort and another thing is uh, I want to put uh, emotion on that you know just put a lot of emotion but don't get confused when you put uh, too much emotion in it because sometimes it gets to be um, kind of tricky in terms of how to express that and maybe you're gonna just you know focus on the wrong placement and you're gonna feel it in the throat no just Put some air, open a little bit the vocal cords a little bit, just to have some. Just you know, instead of just put some more air, edgy and air into that um, tone in order to just you know express it in a better way. Okay, because it may, sometimes it's easier to find the falsetto, of course, because when you're in a falsetto, that vocal cord closure is open. It's not anymore closed. It's just open, and it's easier to reach the falsetto, which is the kind of the thing that is the most important. That's why I'm just... Uh, I told you that uh, uh, it's the best thing and the first thing you have to find out. Good. So if you like this video, please uh, press the like button, subscribe, 
Ah, uh, put in the comments below that you have. Okay, and uh, what you what do you want me to cover next, of course, or wh whatever you feel like. And uh, see you in the next video. Bye bye.